All right, everyone. Welcome to a brand new Two Stupid Gamers episode. I'm Nanners. I'm Zero. And today we're going to be doing episode 13 of our RE remake playthrough. Lucky number 13, mind you. Yes. You know what? I feel like we should have given you this one. That would have been even crazier. It's like first time back in a while and first time you playing it in a while and you hate tank controls. And it's number 13. I mean, how could... It's like... What could possibly go wrong? Could a TSG episode be any more chef's kiss? I, I don't think so. <laughs> no, but no, seriously. Uh, I'm surprised I did as good as I did last time. Like, the fact that I didn't get killed by the freaking snake monster. That's what she said. And, uh... Freaking wow. not having fought Dracula, that... I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I am kind of disappointed at that. Office much, bro? Yeah, no, I mean... Okay, if... I, I guess I gotta be the... This, I gotta be the narcissist here and go, well... To be fair, your performance on the last episode was not ideal up to Resident Evil fans' standards. You did not handle the fights well. <laughs> but no, yeah, you did, you did good and... You took out the snake. You got past the snake and uh, that... That uh, Dracula guy. Dracula wannabe. Unfortunately, you ran out of this room because you were poisoned, which was intentional because it led to a cutscene. And now we gotta figure out what the fuck we're supposed to do here, because there's more stuff. Like, I mean, the 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 room on the map, the room on the map is red, so that means there's something here for us to interact with, and we're kind of lost. So why not? I mean, so why not? So this is this is where we gotta be. Shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's More probably what it is. Shells. Ooh. Now check the map. Or... Yep, that oh. was it. Ah. Well, what do you know? <laughs> that actually pisses me off, because it's like... <laughs> uh, now what? Well, it looks like we gotta explore the area that surrounds this room, because it's all red, bro. Uh, you mean to the south? Yep. No, that we don't go because if we remember, there was that one um, uh, star soldier that got zombified and came back and killed us. Why don't we just go and kill him? No, we we specific. The, the, I think the only thing that's there is like a red herb, but we know that that area is good. We don't oh, have okay. to. Yeah, we don't have to worry much about that anymore. Um, we actually left it specifically. You came up with that. that you fucking five-headed a strategy. Like, why not just ignore it and then we don't have to worry about it? Oh. Well, if it was my idea, it's a great idea. <laughs> uh, screw it. Let's not go there. You're right. Actually, it was my idea. Well, now is it still a great idea? I will fist fight you. Well... It looks like the left side of the mansion on the second floor is pretty yes red but there's a problem so. we we don't have a key uh do we still have that stone thingy yeah we do i don't know if that would this by itself would be useful for anything examine yeah there's like nothing uh, an octagonal shape what's mm. it called a stone and metal what stone and metal object What the fuck was that? What are you talking about? Nothing happened. There you go. Cool. Yeah, so I mean, like, you can't carry every kind of ammo because it's going to take up a slot. And handgun you need because you waste so many of them with any encounter. Uh. I hope that didn't come out. That was weird. It was weird. What the fuck was that? <laughs> You shut up about that. I will mention it. Hmm. Okay, so no, that door we can't get through because that's the helmet key. So I got to go back down and then all, oh, man, all that way. All right, I'm going to be the first to say it. Traversing this mansion is a giant pain in the ass. It's, uh, it's, it's very tedious. So much back and forth. So the broken shotgun is useless. Like you can literally just never touch it again. 
It is literally useless. You've got to be kidding me. I'm dead serious. You cannot fix that thing. You cannot fire it. It is literally just there to make the scene where she goes, where Barry goes, oh, you almost became a Jill sandwich. Oh, dude. That's all it's there for. See, now that sucks on so many levels because a player would come to that point and get that item and go, okay, so this is good for something. Let me hold on to it. Yeah, useless and pointless. It would, yeah, it would basically be wasting a slot. This is why the internet is such an amazing place or thing. Dude, playing this yeah. game before you had the internet, before the internet was a thing, especially the original, must have been really, really tough. Frustrating, maddening, tear inducing. Choose your adjective. I would honestly even suggest like printing out a map of the mansion and just having it all the time yeah i'm for it actually that yeah, sounds you gotta, that sounds you really go cool the, you gotta go to the door yeah there you go that sounds really really cool <laughs> i think that's a good idea doesn't it I, yeah i think i'd want to play it that way it would make it feel more like a kind of adventure type of game hey we're on this adventure together so apparently there is a oh that's the spencer spencer that's the Spencer family uh, uh, thing. Oh, there you go. All right, so I got to get ready to be fighting off dogs. Unfortunately, they, you know what? I'm going to run it. See if we can't run away from them. Oh, we did. Oh, you got to go to the menu and use it. You I can't know, do it here. I know, I know. Freaking button mashing. Shrink. Yes! Oh. Didn't waste a bullet. Didn't take a hit. That's how you play Resident Evil. Ooh. I just put the shotgun shell. You know what? We're good on shotgun shells. On the off chance that we need them, I'll take them. But... Oh, and there's a first aid spray. Look at all this stuff I can't take. There doesn't seem to be any... Yeah. Uh, you know, except that and that. I mean, I would suggest... Oh, yes! Because we need at least something for defense. Dude, there's also more stuff. Like that box. Should I go down or should I go up? Uh, that depends. Which way do you want to try? Whatever. We'll go this way. Oh, I was about to say, she can't open that. So far, so calm. I, know, I hear huh. footsteps. Oh, oh, that's a dog. Oh, fuck. That's a dog. <laughs> it was so, it was so slow. It was so calm, too. I was about to say, oh, that's not weird at all. Grab the shotgun. Next time you go out that way. The shells? No, I mean like your actual shotgun. Blow them away. Yes. I hear something turning. Oh boy. It seems North... to be some kind of signpost. North Valley of Destruction. <laughs> South Cave of Hatred, East Summit of Madness, West Pass of I Revenge? I guess. No, here's the worst part. Oh, she oh, just says it. There we go. In actual clear text. Yeah, you were right. Revenge. So here's the worst part. Listen. Again, someone had to plan this. This this is not a coincidence. Someone named all these areas and decided, hey. I'm gonna make all these traps in the in the mansion. I'm gonna name this area Cave of Madness, uh area of hatred, whatever. Like just burn the whole place down. Like this this has no real value other than trying to kill people. Get it all on fire, screw it. I gotta say. Am I wrong though? 
I have no idea what he's talking about. Yo, we're, look at this. There's like a whole other area for us to explore. I we're, We called it. We called it on day one. We're going to be playing this game forever. <laughs> There's a whole other area to explore. I hope not. Because we're already on episode 13. Look, it's the whole... This took 12 episodes to do. And we're still not done with the mansion. Now we have the courtyard. <laughs> Holy shit. God damn it. I gotta admit, I'm kind of tired of remembering where all these puzzles are. Because there's just so many of them. It's like, oh, here's the blue diamond. You'll need this in like five hours. The war cry of revenge. So I guess what they want to tell me is to make it go for revenge and the other one, the other thingy. I think you need to turn it so that they face each other. If that's even an option. No. Destruction. What did the, uh, the other one was? Was the other oh, one? Oh, you mean like point them in the right direction? Destruction and revenge. Oh, wait. Hold on. All right. There's you're an inscription there. You're going to help me out here. Red revenge. Oh, that's easy to remember. And then the other one was destruction and blue. Destruction okay, well, and blue. Red revenge. Don't worry. It, you, don't you worry your, your pretty little face there on zero. I got this. Did you just say my pretty little face? Fucking, okay, uh... Bitch. What if I did? Uh, Red revenge, blue destruction. Red revenge, blue destruction. Red revenge, blue destruction. So... The red one is going to go north. No, the red one is going to go west. The blue one is going to go north. Gotcha. I'll remember the blue. Red north, red north, red north. No, blue north. Red west. That's good. That's perfect. It's west. Yeah. Now blue is north. So face it north. Jesus. Oh, okay. I was like, wait, that's out of order, isn't it? No. Hooray, we're done with the puzzle. This is really dis disturbing, by the way. I don't want to be here. This is disturbing. The court. I thought the mansion not, was bad. Not the freaking fake Dracula bastard. No. With the furkin masks. That wasn't disturbing. This is this is child's play compared to that bullshit. No. What are you talking about? Now, if zombies start digging themselves out of the freaking graves, that'll be a different story. There's something carved into an indentation. Two vertical lines across and three horizontal lines. Could it be some kind of symbol? I mean, I guess. Nothing written in, in, in there. When the wind sweeps across the earth, stars will shine in the heavens. You don't think the wind crest needs to go there, do you? I think you're onto something. We Which don't have it. We though. need to go back and grab it. Fuck, he's gonna attack me. The crows are gonna attack you? Uh, did you not see them circling, Jill? They actually attack? Yes, they do. I don't like that noise. <laughs> also, you went through the wrong door. You're not going back. The I know. Christ almighty. I don't like this. I don't like it. A large statue stands silently in the darkness. Yeah, it sounded like chains and then a lady. Yeah. Okay, uh, what the hell? Also, dude, you're walking into the wall. <laughs> you have to go up and left. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure where to go. I mean, the camera angles are pretty trash. No, it's, I'm sitting really far from my TV. I didn't realize you'd be going outside today. I thought this was going to be an inside kind of episode. Ooh, there's the path. And they keep changing the angle, too. So are we in another house now? 
Yes, we are. Oh god, a new house. <laughs> a new house. Please only have like three rooms. <laughs> oh, uh, cool. No. We'll take that we later. Have a spray for now. Yeah, exactly. Only one healing item at a time. Come on. What is this amateur hour? I am sure nothing is going to go wrong once we get into this cabin. Well, you have your shotgun equipped, so... Nothing can go wrong, quite literally. Not when you have a shotgun. It fixes all your problems. Quite literally. Not true. Alright, somebody turned that... So, somebody somebody set that fire. So, so, somebody made that. There's somebody here. You think? Unless, for some odd reason that thing can literally burn forever it's the eternal fire it's the next puzzle there's a map of the courtyard take it yes please yas queen okay that's not that bad oh nice. no that's that's not too bad I, I was expecting a lot more so it's not that bad so there's still a few areas we have not traversed yes i'll, I'll say well we would have gone went the it, we would have went the other way, except that I was afraid of that dog. Wait, wait. Go, no, no, no. Go back up the stairs. Hold on. A number of bandages have been hung up. Could these brown stains be blood? Bro, well, if the are stains doing? are brown. Go back up the stairs. Left. Ooh, a typewriter. Oh, okay. Family picture. My dearest Lisa. Daddy attached... Uh, attached first mom. Attached second. Huh? Inside red and slimy white and hard. Not true mom where? Don't know dad. Found mom again. When attached mom my she move no more. She screaming. Why just man to be with her? Mom, where? I miss you. <laughs> I mean, I figured I might as well read it weird since it's written weird. For a second there, I wasn't sure because I'm like, we're on Discord sometimes and sometimes you like to do the robot or sometimes you do robot and I'm just like, oh man. Uh, is he no, robot? That's defin definitely on purpose. Yes, I do have a good view of the entrance of the cabin. Why are you pointing this out to me, game? What are you trying to pull? You're being watched. I'll get you, Gadget. Oh, uh, nice. Dude, the wind crest. And ink ribbons. Should we save? No, we saved uh, before we came here, so we're fine. Again, we only have two ink ribbons. We're down to two. So. We take the crank. Yes, because we have a thing. I wish every item we find in this game was right next to an item box. But what could the crank be good for? Frank Yank? <laughs> oh, that old show. Oh, good. We got everything here. Okay, cool. So let me go put it in the item box. And I'm sure nothing is going to go wrong once we're exiting this door. I'm 100% sure. I'm 1000% positive. Duh. Oh my god, a zombie? A zombie can operate a door, no problem. That's not no zombie. Oh, okay. Is that a cutscene again? Was that it supposed to happen? It's a cutscene. Because you have no control. Is it mommy? Oh, God. I mean, it might not want to kill. Dude, shoot. Uh, yeah, you're gonna kill that thing. 
I'm saying it might not want to kill Jill because it totally had the chance to, but it didn't. She woke up. How many times now has Jill went unconscious and then just woke up and everything was fine? Quite a lot. Just pick it up, uh, use it right away. And pick that shit up. There you go. Grind it. Ah. So that kind of lost all the tension because it was she was creepy for sure and she had tentacles coming out of her, but um Usually that, that leads somewhere completely different. Damn it damn it Hans. I said nothing wrong. I said nothing wrong. She's not even gonna give us chase? That's so weird. And apparently we don't have any reason to go back there, so What's the scary part? I just had to run I mean, past other her. Than the, other than the fact that the bitch had freaking tentacles coming out of her body. Oh, hell no. Oh, this guy is chasing. There's another one. Oh, no, there oh. isn't. That was easy. Easy clap. Easy clap. Clap. I mean, we didn't really clap them. We more like gave them the slip. Go put the go put the freaking wind crest where it goes. Right one. The right one. Damn it! Oh no, we're about to get a hit. What are you doing? Oh my god! Can't can't you shoot? Stupid birds. Oh, so birds. they hit and fly away. Freaking assholes. Ah, oh, there we go. If oh, I had just known. I... Oh, but you don't have enough room. <laughs> Do you remember what the indentation said? Two vertical Two lines. Two vertical lines. And three horizontal, three horizontal lines. lines. Uh... Okay, so I need to see the symbols, the other ones, to even have a guess. Oh my god. I guess if you stand still too much, that's when they start attacking. So there's a moon. Grab one and flip it around. Oh, okay, 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 okay. It's under them that they have symbols. Okay, so the moon so was the, moon, the vertical. The moon, the moon, yeah. Well, that's fine. So the moon had the two vertical lines. So that goes first. What are you doing? You gotta go. So moon first. What? Oh. oh, okay. But then now how were can... they in there? Well, whatever, dude. Just place it now. <laughs> it's not making sense. The good thing is that we don't have to memorize how to do it. We just have to yeah. examine it. That's an angry star. Also, I don't see any button. I thought this game was supposed to be HD. <laughs> I think the button there they're talking about is the actual like symbol. I'll grab that sun. A freaking crow. It it will be night soon, and then the crows will come. <laughs> Squawk. Click. All right. Okay, let's see on the off chance that I'm close enough. I am close enough. Okay, cool. A new gun. Oh, very nice. Has been neatly placed inside. Wow. A magnum. Oh. Yep. Okay, so let me explain. And also, notice it did come with a couple of shells, too. Does, uh, does it use the same kind of shells that our handgun uses? Or no. no? <laughs> All right, Zero. Let me explain to you how the Resident Evil games work. In the Resident Evil games, 
They always start you off with a shitty handgun. And you eventually get a shotgun. And then you eventually get a machine gun or something like that. I guess this one doesn't have a machine gun. We get a magnum... You When you get the magnum revolver, it is practically the best gun in the game. It's you... It isn't always people that like explore the games fully will find a better weapon like through uh, upgrading them and stuff. But the Magnum revolver, generally speaking, is the best gun that you just get like flat out. It has special ammo though, and that ammo is absolutely precious. You never use it. You save it for the bosses. You save it for like when it's absolutely necessary. Um. Yeah. So basically, we're not touching that damn revolver. No, we're gonna go dump it in the item box. Oh, which would have been perfect. We could have went up there for the item box, but we're not dealing with that freaking tentacle bitch. I am not. Plus, going... the courtyard and everything seems done now. Like we don't have to explore it any any further. That part of the From courtyard. That area, yeah. That yeah. that half. Mind you. Which, which I'm surprised we were able to get done in one episode. Yeah, seriously, we actually did quite a bit. So, uh, yeah, I will. Uh, I'll just kind of go dump the uh magnum and save and stuff like that but guys thank you so much for catching this has been lucky episode number 13 i guess it was lucky after all we got a sweet ass gun let us know what you think in the comments below uh would you use the magnum would you like the magnum which is your favorite gun i already know which one's mine the shotgun all right we'll catch you all on episode 14 till next time everyone bye bye